So you have mm -hmm. uh, over 5,000 sellers at this point? Yes. Yes, we have. Uh, that's in our first year. The app's only been around for about one year now. So okay. we're moving into year two. And um, we have, it's all been word of mouth. We've barely done any paid promotion at all. So yeah, those 5,000 were all word of mouth, which uh, I think just says that our product is a, is a good value for the yeah. seller and the buyer and the buyer. Uh, we get a lot of repeat orders for sure. Uh, yeah, so let's talk a little bit about, so there's a couple things about why jewelry is so good. Obviously, the, the, the big thing is that it's, uh, th that it's got a good markup. You can essentially three or four or even mm -hmm. 5x the, the cost that you pay in order to fulfill it. The other thing is how easy it is to ship. Uh, it's it's so small. Mm -hmm. It comes. Your, and the other option is you guys actually provide customized um, customized packaging uh, on request as well, which I think is a really cool thing that really helps that customer experience. It's easy to ship, and because you guys actually are centered in the U.S., uh, it, shipping times are great throughout the U.S. And you don't have to worry about any of this stuff coming down the pipe with uh, with the e packet with the Trump's uh, repealing of the of the, the trade. You know the 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 shipping subsidy essentially so talk a little bit about that i think we're going to see more industries not just print on demand but more industries in general moving to an on-demand manufacturing model mm. uh, it's a really difficult thing to set up but the it allows better cash flow for everybody so i think we're just starting with businesses like ours and, and t-shirts but it's going to be in all sorts of stuff for me, I mean, I'm not here to make a quick buck. You know, I'm going to be in this for the long haul. And so I have to really consider the trends that are happening. Um, you know, we want it to be made here. We want it to be made by moms. You know, we have about 20 or 30 mothers that are making all of our sellers jewelry, which is really fun. My favorite thing in the world is to go in in the morning and with my coffee and talk to all the moms after they drop off their kids from school. So you know, there's a lot of uh, investment that goes on in doing this all in America, but over time, it's going to be well worth it from everybody, from uh, ideas that we come up with. You know, we just hired a second full-time videographer, photographer, so we have two now that are full-time. Uh, we have like a lot, we do a live video service. We'll actually manufacture your item and then we'll um, take videos for you. Um, and I can talk more about that in, in Bangkok for sure. Um, so there's, we're investing a lot right now. You know, we're reinvesting everything that's sort of made back into the more machinery and, and better ideas and new products for our sellers. So it's just a different mindset. I think that a lot of people who want to make a quick, a quick buck, you know, and then that's with ePacket, cool. I'm yeah, with ePacket, I mean, we've, I've been, I've I've just had it in the back of my head. Like I know it. I knew at some point, you know, something was gonna was gonna blow. Um, with that, basically subsidizing packages coming from China, mm -hmm. it's more expensive for us to ship it than it does for AliExpress. But it's just um, things are going to be be more even in the near future, um, which makes our offer even you know better. Yeah, and it's it's the like just going through your checkout process and your. The, you know the the write-ups that you have built into the Julia already. It's just it's a really attractive product, and I imagine for the market, the fact that it's produced in the U.S., produced by by moms, is just part of that investment that helps sell all of your customers' jewelry. Like I think it's a really it's a really cool mindset, and it's something that uh, that it, it's worth jumping on and taking a look because of how much you guys are investing in the in the whole experience. Yeah, I mean, it's we really slow it down. We slow everything down. We write, you know, I based on my long experience with jewelry, you know, I'm at all the copy you see in those products. I'm actually the one writing it, you know, like I, <laughs> people are like, Eric, you shouldn't be doing this stuff. But I'm like, no, man, like I, I, I think I know, you know, my long jewelry experience, what what people want to hear. So, yeah, uh, That's I'm, funny. I'm all write... over the place. They say the same thing to me, Eric, you don't need to write all the website texts, but I'm like, no, I have to, I've been, I've been to all these events. I know, I know what people want. So do you want to hear more from Eric, uh, on these topics?